Hey guys, this is Keeping It Real Cooking with Michael. Michael is actually, he's here every once in a while. He cooks up a really nice dish for us guys working hard here at Delaware Paddle Sports at lunchtime. Michael, take it away, brother. Yeah, right. man. How's everybody doing out there today? We're going to cook some fish today for the boys at the shop. We're going to take some fresh farm to table ingredients. We're going to take some nice fresh fish. We've got tog, we've got speckled sea trout and we're gonna make a couple nice dishes for you all at home. Now the two dishes we're gonna to do today, we're gonna to do a fresh tog fish and chips. It's gonna have a spaghetti squash and pickled onion slaw with potato chips. And we're gonna incorporate, we're gonna do a nice beer batter. I'm gonna show you how to make that. So first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna have two parts flour to one part cornstarch. We're gonna mix in our Miller Lite beer. We're going to use a nice high carbonated beer. take a fork and just kind of pull out the squash and it looks like spaghetti. Let me do it this way so you can see it a little better. So this is going to be our slaw. Stop it right now. So Michael, this is going to be like the slaw of this. Dude, that's hot, man. This is the cold slaw. Yeah, okay, so yeah. Get going. you some. Get you some, Michael. We're going to hit it with a little bit of cilantro. We've got the pickling liquid from the onions already in there. That's going to bring out our flavor. That's just a little red wine vinegar, extra virgin olive oil, and some sea salt and sugar. All right. So now we're ready to cut up our potatoes for our chips. Potatoes are ready to go. And they're going to go right in the fryer. Oil's nice and hot. Woo. Now we're not in a commercial kitchen. We're here at the shop, so we don't have a fryer basket. We don't have tongs. We use what we got here at the shop.
fish is fresh out of the water. It was a beautiful fish called by Dean here at the shop. Now we here at the shop, we like to release probably 99% of what we catch. But every once in a while, we'll keep one, we'll bring it back for a nice treat for everybody at the shop. So the first thing we're gonna do to get this started is we're gonna make a beer blanc. We're gonna take this Julius Treehouse out of Munson, Massachusetts, a really nice beer. We're gonna take it, we're gonna put it into a little stock pot and start reducing that down. So our next dish we're gonna to go to here, we're gonna to go to the speckled sea trout. It's gonna be a pan roasted, skin on, crispy skin, speckled sea trout. It's gonna be with a sweet potato, bacon, and roasted corn hash, and grilled asparagus with a Julius Treehouse beer beurre blanc. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get our fish ready to cook it crispy skin down. Now, the first thing you have to do is to try to get all the oils out of your fish. Get your skin nice and dry. So what I do is I run the knife along the fish against the scales. This will also help clean all the scales off. You're going to clean your knife off. We'll use this cutting board over here. And now we're going to go against it the opposite way. And if you look at the back of the knife, you can see the oils coming out of the fish, which is what you want. You want to be really careful using the sharp end. You want to do this a few times and just bring everything out. Thick pan preferably. So we're gonna put a little bit of oil in here. The pan is nice and hot, it's been on the heat for a while. Put a little peanut oil. A little butter. salt on the fish, kind of pat that in, we got a nice brown butter in here now, and then it's important to go ahead and put a little weight to start on the fish. You want to make sure that skin is in constant contact with the pan to get a nice, even golden brown throughout. While the fish is cooking, we're going to take our asparagus, which is already coated in oil. We're also going to season that with a little sea salt. cook it too much though. We're just going to let that hit the grill grate for about 10 seconds. Make sure we have some nice even grill marks on there. And now we're going to go ahead and we're going to remove it from the heat because we don't want it to overcook. So we're going to bring it up here just to sit and wait for a little bit. Our fish, we're going to check that and see what our crust looks like. 
That looks to be a beautiful golden brown. So we're going to go ahead and flip that over. Beautiful looking piece of fish, nice crisp skin. We're going to let it let the speckled sea trout go for about 10 more seconds. And then we're going to remove it off the heat. This is going to continue to cook over here on the warm grill. We also have our beer reduction, our treehouse beer reduction, which is almost there. It's reducing down. We want it to barely coat the bottom of the pan. Okay? So our pan's still hot. While it's still hot, we're going to throw in a little smoked applewood bacon. along with our sweet potatoes. And let that get started. All right, we're back and our sweet potatoes are about done. Our bacon is about crispy. So we're gonna add in our final ingredients. We've got a little bit of sweet corn. yellow bell pepper. We're going to toss that around a little bit. Get everything cooked up. When I find my sea salt, we're going to season it with just a little tiny bit of sea salt, not too much. And we're going to let that go for another minute. We're going to finish the dish off. A little bit of scallion for color, a little onion flavor in there, a little aromatics. And that's about ready to go to the plate. Our reduction of the treehouse beer is ready. We're going to take some whole butter. And mix that right in with the beer reduction. And a little pinch of sea salt. Mix that around. And that's going to make a beautiful little sauce for our fish, for our speckled sea trout. Salt is ready to go. Butter just has to melt. That's it. Now we're going to go to the plate. We've got our hashes ready. with our treehouse beer for Blanc. There's your speckled trout. So we've got our two dishes laid out for our two fish. We have our speckled sea trout caught by Dean with the sweet potato, applewood bacon, and corn hash. With grilled asparagus and a treehouse beer for Blanc. Me, there you go, buddy. Oh, for you. Pleasure. Thank you, guys. We also have our tall tall fish and chips with uh, spaghetti squash and pickled onion slaw and a little bit of tartar sauce on the side. Kevin, thank you, Enjoy, Chef buddy.
got that pork. Yeah, now we the better. Mm. Yeah.